Hey guys, it's Zeng here and welcome to another episode of Clash Wartime. So this episode is going to prepare for a new series I'm planning where I will be showing you guys how I draw my attack plan. I can't stress how important it is to detail your attack strategy before hitting that go button. Likewise, it also gives you the chance to share your attack with clanmates on GroupMe or LineChat for a second opinion before you actually start your raid. Personally, I believe drawing out a solid game plan can potentially bring you to the next level in Clan Wars if you're not doing it already. I remember before I never really used to do it because I just got really, really lazy, but ever since I started using Laloon and Surgical Hogs attacks, it really, really made a difference on gaining that extra star in a free star attack. I've been drawing out my attacks for quite some time now, so I'm going to show you quickly how I do this. Alright guys, so Doodle is an app where you can overlay a Clash of Clans picture or any picture and you can draw over it. Uh, you can get this from the App Store, as you can see here I'll search it for you. Alright, Doodle. Um, right, this is the app, it's called You Doodle actually, not Doodle. So it's the one with the paint palette. You want to download this one. Make sure you get a good look at this. So once you've downloaded it, go up here, here and you can open it up. This is one that I've drawn recently. Uh, I don't think I actually made a successful attack out of this, but uh, you can see there's paint brushes here. You can choose different colours and draw on it. Um, I'll show you an example of what I do when uh, I pick a base, after I pick a base on Clash. So you want to open up Clash up. Alright, so you're in Clash, go into your clan war or farm. Usually it's in clan wars, I don't usually do this for farming. So for example, take this base that I attacked recently, take a screenshot, hold the home button down and press your lock button on iOS. Um, I'm not actually too sure how you would do this on Android so maybe check online, uh, Google or YouTube to find a tutorial on that. Uh, after you get the screenshot, come out of it, go into Doodle again. Um, this little plus sign on the top right corner. You want to draw on top of a photo, take it from your camera roll. Alright, so you've got your screen here. I actually can't remember how I attacked this base, but uh, I'll give you just a quick tour on how I would draw on top of it. So the top one is your drawing tools. Um, you can change the size of it. There's the eraser at the bottom. If you make a mistake you can uh, get rid of it um, there's also other various tools if you don't want to handwrite it you can actually add a text box but I generally try to uh, handwrite mine so I, I do not know how to delete this but never mind let me just leave that there sorry guys I actually don't know how to delete that, but never mind, leave that there, alright, okay, this is the U there. So that's the text box. Um, so to draw on it, use, I usually use colour code it as well. So for example, I'll go two golems here, uh, blue for wizards, take a wizard there, take a wizard there to funnel, and a couple of wizards here. And then I usually use a yellow for my heroes, so Queen goes in first, IQ, I don't know why I did that, but Queen goes in first here. And then King will usually come afterwards. Uh, and then spells of course, so the jump spell will go here. Um, lightning spell for the hand castle troops. <laughs> I forgot to mention guys, you might want to check the defense um, distances as well before you actually start drawing so you get an idea on whether if your golems will attract the defenses or not or your clan cast their clan castle. 
will get attracted off your jump spell. Um, so after this, so this was a Laloon attack actually. So so after that, because I'm trying to take out the Queen here, as well as these two air defenses, as well as the air sweeper, and it actually made my attack really smooth. That's how I got the three stars. Um, right, and then the lava pups will go in here and here, and then the final one here. And then what I like about this tool is you can just do whatever you want with it. It's really flexible, so hopefully this, this will help you guys out. Really um, get that third star, that really annoying third star, which I. I always mess up as well, so don't worry about that. So, for balloons, I would just put a 2 there, maybe 4 there, 4 there, 4 there, 3 there, um, and then also your rage spells. Like, literally, guys, you can do whatever you want. You don't have to do it this way, but it's really flexible. There's the text boxes um, that you can use. Um, but colour codes, I find it really simple, so if you want to do it my way, feel free. Um, I'll show you how to properly plan a Laloon attack in future episodes, but this one is just a general um, idea on how to use Doodle. Um, hopefully this will help you guys out. Hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. I know it was a quick one, but hopefully this will bring you a little closer to landing that annoying third star. Alright, that's pretty much it for me, guys. Share the video to clan mates who are new to clan wars and subscribe if you haven't already. Alright, take it easy. Peace out.